in this video we are going to discuss two gate problems on integral controller we already discussed about integral controller integral integral controller is generally used to decrease the steady state error so that means used to decrease the steady state error means don't think that is not going to eliminate the steady state error obviously that is going to use for the elimination of steady state error so here you can see the first question in uh, gate 97 so introduction of integral action in the forward path of a unity feedback system results in a marginally stable system system with no steady state error system with increased stability system with better speed generally if you are having any control system like this so this is called as forward path this forward path gain always will think it as g of s so whatever the controllers we are having either that is proportional or integral or differential or proportional integral proportional differential proportional integral differential whatever controller is there if you want to integrate that controller in this control system to improve the functionality of the control system that you just insert in forward path only whenever you are integrating any controller in a control system that you need to integrate in forward path that's why in all our analysis related to controllers i inserted the particular controller here here means forward path so that's what he is saying introduction of integral action integral action is nothing but integral controller introduction of integral controller in the forward path of unity feedback system results in so for what purpose we are using integral controller to eliminate the steady state error so in this option system with no steady state error it will results it will results which type of system by increasing that integration you are going to eliminate the steady state error finally the main intention of your controller is that will controls controls and up to up to at uh, at which point that uh, that will show that action that will show that action up to you are getting your error is equivalent to zero because always output is proportional to error signal if error signal is zero that means steady state error is zero then your controller will stop working up to that point to up to reaching that point it will work definitely it will work so the main intention of integral controller is to reduce the steady state error and to eliminate the steady state error finally it need to eliminate so this is your option system so after taking that integral action in your forward path the system will be a system with no steady state error and coming to another previous gate problem an integral controller is used to this is given in gate 2002 improve the transient response reduce the offset eliminate the offset reduce the settling time you will confuse here generally whenever you are hearing about integral controller one thing will come into your mind that is going to decrease the steady state error but here no one option is related to steady state error for scene for scene no option is there which is worded like it is going to reduce steady state error like that they give an offset and improves the transient response and this a option will drag you to that point to pick this option but that entirely wrong why because if that is proportional integral controller then this option is perfect proportional integral controller will increase or improve this transient response but not integral controller individually if that is proportional integral controller then there is a scope to improve the transient response but they are not asking 
proportional integral controller when people are not having choice related to their answer they will choose near answer like that if they are asking integral controller if you are not having any words related to you you are about to choose this option why because this is for proportional integral so this is also integral and this is also integral controller then you are going to select this this is entirely wrong so now one thing is why we are using integral controller to eliminate the steady state error steady state error is nothing but offset if you know that point then you can't lose this option eliminate the offset so this is the option which is apt for this question an integral controller is used to eliminate the offset if this option is not there then you can choose this reduce the offset it's not only reducing the offset it will eliminate the offset it will reduce us reduce us reduce us the steady state error finally it will eliminate the steady state error when two similar options are given then you need to see the weightage apt this is apt finally it will eliminates the offset or steady state error so this is the right option for this problem like this way you need to think uh, questions in gate related to controllers